the asphalt mix time. Now we are going to start right from the beginning that what is asphalt mix design, what are the objectives of this mix design and uh, after that how this mix design is developed. We will go through each and every step in sequence way. So that's why it is our first preliminary discussion. First of all, we have to know about the objective. Before we start explaining this objective, mixed design, we will have to develop in such a way that final product is obtained in some economical way. Also, this blend, this bitumen content which is used for the development of the mix design, it should be attained in such a way that we have reached to our final conclusion or to the target with the least value because of the cost effectiveness. So, after why we want to develop this as far as mix design, so you know, all our roads black top road consisting of base course, bearing course and sometimes intermediate layer known as a binder course. We have to develop such a road which is durable. And how this durability can be obtained? Due to bitumen. My first objective. Second objective, strength. Strength of this. What do we mean by strength? It should possess certain resistance that our material used for the mixed design, when it is in the use, it should resist to the deformation when the temperature is increasing. So, so this is known as the strength. It should be strong enough. Third point. Stability. Means this road should having this characteristics that it should not possess distortion, it should not be disturbed easily under traffic, heavy volume of the traffic. Fourth one, air voids. The air wires all our technical specification always mention some type of the air wires are necessary. So that's why this air wire, it is also our objective that in the compacted bitumen we have some air wires because during its service life, during the imposed load, air wires are going to be compressed, its value is going to be reduced. That's why in the preliminary say the air wires are also required. Fifth one, we will study one property in detail later known as the flow value. Flow is related with the flexibility. So, so we should have to obtain this property of known as flexibility. Flexibility save the road from cracking and also it possess the property to maintain its shape when the imposed load is reduced. 
0.61 our top surface known as the surface cores are known as the varying cores so, so for the surface cores which whenever we have developed the material this is known as the surface mix you know this aggregates are used proper texture of aggregate required and it should be hardened enough to provide the skid resistance so, so these are the just brief introduction about the development of the mixture what are the objective what we want to achieve what we want to gain after the objective of the mixture now we will proceed for its second phase. Okay. Overview of the design process. Here we will explain step by step sequences for the development of the mix design. First part type of mix to which type of the mix is being developed for base course for the varying course or some other so that's why we need to define type of the mix so we will have to type of the mix either it is base course or varying course or binding course second one the material as you already know material is the combination of aggregate filler and bitumen Its third aggregates fillers. We will have to study the properties of aggregates. We will study in detail about the properties of aggregate. That these aggregates are complying to the technical requirement or not. When we have studied the properties of the aggregate, fourth one, this bitumen content, we have to select the bitumen type. because there are many types of the bitumen to be used for the development of the mixing so here we have to select the type of the bitumen after the selection you know these aggregates and these bitumen we have to mix up with each other for their mixing we should know what is the temperature required so that's why now we will define the fifth part of this mix is mixing and compaction temperature. This will be given you in detail when we will start developing of this mix is to that what is the mixing temperature and what is the compaction temperature. Six one. Now, when we say mixing and compaction temperature, it means now we have reached to the conclusion to prepare the mix sign. Means that mix sign is developed. Over here, whatever the sample you have obtained, known as the master sample, we will do the density 
and white lenses. When this density and white analysis is done, next we will study the martial properties known as the stability and flow analysis. Now this stability and flow analysis is known. Next, remember, we will have to study the volumetric properties. What do you mean by volumetric properties? It means we have to find out air wires, we have to find out wires in mineral aggregates, we have to find out wires filled with asphalt, we can PBE and PBA. Asphalt absorb and effective asphalt content, these are based in the volumetric property. Now, all of my calculation means if I include this thing along with this one in my previous step, I have told you I have found out the stability and I have also found out the flow and I have also found out the density. Now there are six properties. One, Two, three, four, five, and six properties. These six properties, along with, I will write down just over it, six property. Versus percentage of bitumen. These about six property percent percent they left bitumen grass will be plotted. From this graph. We will select one point known as the selection of binder printer. Optimum binder printer. When we have Done selection of this optimum binder content. We will meet the analysis with other properties. Means the verification. is done, we will reach to the conclusion that it is the final selection of next time. Okay. 
Now in our coming videos, we will go on explaining each of these steps in detail. So, so this is just summary that what is the procedure and what is the flow chart in other words you can say that for the development of Bixen that I have given you in my 12 handling. Now each of these will be explained in detail in the coming videos. Thank you for seeing this.